Hi guys, welcome to Mooch's Ways channel. Um, so I was out ferreting today on a fairly new piece of permission. Um, being with the weather that we've had, we've had a week of quite warm weather. And before that we had uh, <clears throat> like quite a long spell of rain. So I got there today and the cover had shot right up. Uh, so not really ideal. Um, we did catch some rabbits. I didn't actually get any rabbits filmed bolting. Uh, just because of the cover. Uh, a lot of the warrens we long netted around. Um, we finished on eight anyway. Um, and we dug to a nest of babies. I have got a little bit of footage which I'm going to put on and show you. Uh, unfortunately no bolts. But just really to show you the uh, the warrens and whatnot. Now... Um, I know a lot of people this time of year, uh, as I said in my previous video, won't be ferreting. And I posted my result on um, Facebook, on a Facebook ferreting group, and obviously got a little bit of stick from a few people. The reason I carry on ferreting during the uh, spring and summer months is because um, I cover a lot of ground, and this particular piece. I've not long picked up and there's a lot of rabbits there. Now the farmer wants the rabbits reducing. So really, because I've just got it to show willing, I'm going to go there every few weeks and just chip away at them. I'm not expecting to get big bags now uh, because of the cover and the young rabbit situation. It makes it a pain in the ass to ferret. This particular farm I can't actually shoot because it's a very, very sensitive site. I'm not actually going to give a location away for obvious reasons, but let me tell you, it's a very sensitive site with quite a high police presence. So it's not something that you want to go with a firearm. There's also quite a lot of walkers that go there. So it's not ideal. So ferreting is the most discreet way to go about it. Um, I spoke to the farmer today. Uh, he's happy with my efforts. Um, as I say, I got eight and then I dug to a nest. So... 14, 15 rabbits in reality, you know. Um, none of them go to waste. The young ones will go as ferret food. Uh, obviously, this time of year, you're going to, um, being as as young rabbits, you're going to have digs. Um, but it's all part and parcel of ferreting. You just dig, you get on with it, and you move on. Uh, it was quite warm today, so I didn't take a dog with me. Uh, it's... You know, worth noting, when it's warm weather, ferrets do suffer slightly in the heat. Well, I say slightly, they can um, get heat stroke quite easily. So if you're going to ferret in the summer, go earlier in the morning. Try not to be in sort of like the, the still going in the heat of the day. Um, and I take plenty of water with me to keep the ferrets hydrated and cooled off. Um, so yeah, we're going to keep chipping away at this place and I spoke to the farmer today as I've already said he's happy with the efforts so I've, I've been there twice. I had six last time and uh, the eight 
eight rabbits in the nest of babies so you know um you're looking at 20 odd since i've got this place um but i've said to him you know it, i'll keep chipping away at them and then come autumn winter when the cover dies back um there's a lot of rabbits there so what i'll do next time i'll go there i'll try and film some of the rabbits because there was a lot above ground today um you know if you see we, we must have seen a good 30 30 odd 40 rabbits running around during the day you know so it gives you the scare if you're seeing that many during the day there's generally a lot there which there is so um but I, as i've said once the autumn winter comes and we can get to the warrens properly without all the cover and the young that's when we'll start bagging up really so uh yeah just uh watch a few clips that i that i filmed today and uh hope you enjoy and i'll be back soon with another video um i've got a, another little foxing job coming up and so i'll try and get that filmed um and i've got some other rabbit in coming up uh, maybe some pigeon shooting soon actually uh, that my mate mentioned to me so uh, there'll definitely be some more content so cheers guys hope you enjoy Warren under this bramble patch here just long netting all the way around it Liam is don't know if you can see, we're just packing up the long net now. Um, we've only been here 20 minutes, but this whole bramble patch around this dead tree is one big warren. And uh, I didn't really look at it properly last time, but I thought, oh, bugger it, we'll have a go this time. Um, I only bought three ferrets, so my mistake. Didn't have enough ferrets for it. Um, but we did bolt and catch two. Little half grow, little young one, but this is pest control, so they all need to go. Um, no dog with me today, it's a little bit warm. Um, but what we're going to do is, we are going to head over here, over the rise here, near the wood line. There's a few, we're going to have a few out there, so stay with us. Hopefully, get some better footage on some smaller warrens. Feel anything? Nest. Yeah. Hi. <sighs> Ferreting in the summer, unfortunately, you'll come across nests, but this is uh, best control, so it has to be done, unfortunately. <laughs> 